minimum qualities are required to be a good manager or administrator? <coughs> See again, there are three three qualities which are very important. The leader of, or the management, administrative head, he must show first what he wants others to do. That's one. Second thing, he should make a team. Every every no administrator, nobody today, nobody today can work as a single person. Today, if you go out in the US, uh, any big organization, the biggest um, value which they will give you, the person will give you, the last line is always written in your testimonial, which is not shown to you in the US. They don't show you testimonial. They write out two things, two lines. One line is, he can work in a team. Number two, this is one line. And the second line is that he is very good, but he cannot work in a team. You know what are the repercussions are by these two lines? Can you guess? Intelligent guess? Sir, maybe that uh, even if a person is very good and if he is not able to do work, take people along with him, he is actually a misfit. He might today, if you <laughs> carry if you carry a line in your bio in your testimony that he cannot work in a team, you can never be hired in a organization. Yes, Nobody will hire you. Nobody will touch you when they write he cannot work in a team. Nobody wants I today. Today everyone is we. And that's what even the chief Chief will not say, I did this, we did this. And this is what is the greatest quality of today. And until next, in India also, we do this, that we come back and say, we did it, not I did it. And that's the biggest quality today. For any administrator, any leader, any uh, organization, it has to be we. And we means participation for everyone. We should, uh, the youngest person or the lowest person or the youngest one or the lowest person of the organization should feel that he is part of the hospital or he is part of the organization. Then the organization will grow. But if I say that I am the boss and I, everyone is a, my subordinate, that organization is finished. It will never grow. In the era of in, even the business administration, in the businesses today, that era of one, the owner and uh, everyone working has changed now. They are all management people, they are all organized people, they are all different people are human, they are different responsibilities and they are all working as a team again. Not single man. Single businessman used to run the empire, he was all right. But he cannot work now. So it's a team building, leadership and leadership leading in front. Look at the army today. Look at the army. The army, the biggest leadership is that the officer does first, he will do first, then the man will do. Because so they have to give their life. And if the officer is not in front, the man will learn from the back. So same way in our organization. Every, every person has to do and show by his own work. That keeps the problem.